What's going on guys, Zach here, and welcome to this week's episode of Uplay. It's a first-person shooter mystery game with some big ideas for a story. Currently, it only has the standard FPS mechanics and a simple currency system to upgrade your character. There's not too many features in it, other than four distinct weapons, weapon inventory and ammo systems, orb currency system, mobile optimization, and touch-based controls. The game was made in Game Maker Studio, and it is still in development. Take a look. Rude Boy Rampage, an inspired Pokemon game, this is a top-down shooter with three unlockable Pokemon, each with unlockable weapons specific to each one. Talk to people in town to enter a level and defeat waves of enemies. This game was made with Game Maker Studio, it took about two months to make, and it was originally on Game Jolt. It's still in development now, but take a look. Neon Cube is a 2D platformer based around a neon world. The goal in the 50 included levels is as simple as opening a door and entering the next level. This seems easy at the beginning, but as your level progress increases, you might find yourself in a tricky situation, especially the 5 bosses every 10 levels may increase the probability of ending up as a pile of neon shards. Features include a level editor, a single player and a multiplayer campaign, player customization, achievements, and a trading card to fulfill your desires. The game was made in Game Maker Studio and it took about three years to complete. Go ahead and take a look. All right, that's going to be it for today. Go ahead and like, go and subscribe, and let me know what you think about the games. Let's start a discussion going in the comments section. I always like talking to you guys. And check the description to see how you can get your game into Uplay. All right, peace.